Welcome back and happy Thursday. We're going to take you out to Pismo Beach right now. It looks beautiful. They still have that Christmas tree out at the end of the pier, so they're still feeling pretty seasonal. You can see we do have some cloudy conditions out along the coast, and we are anticipating some rain in Pismo and other parts of San Luis Obispo County in the next hour or so. And that brings us up to our microclimate model right now. You can see here that this rain is becoming a little bit more widespread by the 8 o'clock hour here. So it's starting in the north coast region. They're probably getting a few sprinkles right now. It's traveling down the coast here and then by about 10 o'clock that's when it'll start to reach parts of Santa Barbara County and we come, become a little bit more widespread here and it'll continue to make that shift here through about noon even some possibility here for some mountain snow in Santa Barbara County. But by two, three o'clock this afternoon, that's when we're expecting the system to already start to clear up. After that, we're left with partly cloudy skies in the mountains and foothills, and then otherwise clear skies along the coastline. This will continue to be your trend through Friday morning, as you can see right here with this map. So mostly sunny skies going into your weekend, and that should be the case as we go into Saturday morning as well. Rain potential for the system is going to be pretty light. As you can see, we're expecting it to be under about a quarter of an inch when the storm is all said and done. The next opportunity for rainfall will actually be on Monday. We're expecting another, another light system by then as well. Wind forecast does show that we're really going to start to ramp up here going into late morning, early afternoon, and you can tell just by how much this this map starts to light up. These sustaining winds at times could get close to 40 miles per hour. It does start to taper off later tonight into early tomorrow morning. You can see those winds get closer to about 20 to 25 miles per hour instead of being close to about 40 miles per hour. Here's a look at that satellite radar. You can see that that rain is starting to make its way over the county line in San Luis Obispo County. We do have a high surf advisory in place. This is for Slow County in northern Santa Barbara County. It will expire tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Those waves will range from about 8 to 12 feet. Wind advisory still in place this one until Friday morning as well. But like I said, those winds ranging from 20 to 30 miles per hour, just sustaining winds. And then those wind gusts could get up to about 50 miles per hour at their peak. Daytime highs will still be on the cooler side for your Thursday, mid 50s for pa Paso Robles and mid 60s today for Santa Barbara, right around the upper 50s to the low 60s for the Santanas Valley. And we're staying close to those low 60s as well for the five cities region. You can see here that not much is changing temperature wise. We're staying pretty consistent with what we had yesterday. Daytime highs for San Miguel, Atascadero, mid 50s, and then a longer north coast. We're pretty close to the upper 50s and low 60s. Back to you. Thanks, Brooke. Time right